The United Nations will observe the national dialogue called by the government, although it lacks support from the people. Eight months after a presidential election, we begin a dialogue process. The international community is helping us resolve the political crisis. Parties involved in the process will discuss fraud, electoral reforms and human rights. But the government delegate has said they won't discuss about the deaths occurred during the post-electoral protest. Only a judge can rule if these deaths were the result of violence or if there were homicides. That's what the country law says. Former presidential candidate Salvador Nasraya will take part in the dialogue table, but he will not be joined by the Libre Party that supported his candidacy last year. I want to stress that I still haven't signed any agreement regarding the political dialogue. I'm waiting on the government to fulfill one of the commitments that it offered to reach this dialogue. The Refundación y Libertad Party has said it will not join the dialogue either. They are demanding international mediation and a dialogue that is binding. We're asking for an international mediator and that all resolutions that are reached are binding. Our demands haven't been heard. As the national dialogue begins, people prepare to protest. They demand early elections and a national dialogue that includes every sector of society.